Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Evic, and this is Tomb Raider Anniversary. The level is St. Francis's Folly. It's the first level in the Greek set, and it has six artifacts, zero relics, and no particularly special treasures. So, <clears throat> in order to get the first artifact, once you find this uh, carving here, um, you're going to go ahead and want to shoot this particular pattern of stars that you see and that will open a sliding grate just down this way and over and up and it is right here look at that all right only five more to go well there's five more relics and they are each found through this room here now, there are four doors, like this is, uh, oh, Hephaestus, and there's also Poseidon, Atlas, and Damocles. Each one of those doors has one artifact in it. The fifth artifact is, I don't know if you can see it, woo, right there below the door. Um, right, well, I believe... <clears throat> The first one to get is actually the Hyphaestus artifact, so uh, I'll go ahead and show you how to grab it. Alright, so here we are in Hephaestus' room, or the one with the hammer. Just make the hammer come down, get up, go over here, take this first spinny pole, jump right off, and it's in this alcove right there. All right. All right. The next room is Poseidon's room. Now, what you're going to want to do is flood the room as high as you can, just like so. Then we just dive right on in and and pull the very, very bottom switch, wherever it may be. There we are. You can pull the switch before you flood the room, but that doesn't really matter. You can't actually get to the relic until the room itself is flooded. And we'll just swim around until we see where it is. There it is, right there. And that is how you get the Poseidon one. So here we are in the Atlas room. This is the switch that uh, closes the hole in the floor there. All you gotta do is pull that switch, go up this ledge, and it's right there. That is super awesome. Now the next artifact is actually just outside Atlas's room. So let's go ahead and do a crappy fade cut and I will meet you there. So here we are, just outside Atlas's room. You can see the artifact is there. Now, it's pretty obvious that uh, all we have to do is uh, a little bit of a ledge puzzle here. So, let's go ahead and do that. Drop, drop. Over, 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 drop, go. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. All that's left is uh, Damocles which not only is it the hardest puzzle, in my opinion, it's also the hardest artifact. So, crappy fade cut, array! Okay, so once you navigate your way to this part of the Damocles room, just pull this little switch here, and that will make those spikes go down, which is great. And the fastest way to get back to those spikes is to line up one of these super annoying jumps, Awesome. Jump over. And over. Sorry about that pause there. I'm just gonna grab this little health pack. Now, let's see if I can do this in one go. <coughs> Pardon me. Let's see if I can do this in one go. Up. Swing and a miss. No. Well, anyway, all you have to do is swing up there and um, grab the ledge, jump over, grab the artifact. So I said this is the most difficult artifact of the whole 
finally. It's the most difficult artifact of the whole level. And because of the way the camera works, it's also, in my opinion, the most difficult, um, the most difficult puzzle. There it is. That's all there is to it. <laughs> 